So this is Tunguska. Yikes. It's good to be back in the USSR, but this place makes the rest of Siberia look tropical. Yeah, a little nippy. I better incinerate something for heat before my tool falls off. Can't have that. But I think we can arrange an opportunity for creative combustion. We need to gather intelligence on Project Solaris. Want to help me out? You know it, sugar. What do you need me to do? I'm not sure yet. I'll know more after Agent Sergei briefs me. Sergei? Ah, oh, man. Not him again. Yes, him again. He's been here for weeks, digging up intel on Project Solaris. Yeah, he's a regular 007 off. What's he got that I ain't got? Hair, for one thing. Here he comes. Let me do the talking. Ukraine girls knock me out. Moscow girls make me shout. It's good to see you, Sergei. Natalyushka, you look devastating, as usual. I know, but we have no time for further verbal foreplay. What can you tell me of Project Solaris? Not as much as I'd like. Not as much as I'd like. There is a classified area nearby, obscured day and night by a cloud of radioactive gas. I believe it is the source of the insidious organic weapons being used to subjugate. Svolochi. Ah. The area plans are kept in a high security section of KGB headquarters. Can you sneak us in? You and your little Zaitchik? I don't see how. Now, if it were just the two of us. Jealousy, Sergei? Though the fire fades, comrade, the embers may yet smolder. Even in the tundra. Thank you, comrade. We'll find our own way in. Now go. You mustn't be seen with me. So, exactly what kind of history do you have with this Sergei guy? Exactly the kind you think, Crypto. Not that it's any of your business. Hey, see whoever you want. You can bang the Red Army Chorus for all I care. Your permission is noted. Now can we get to work? Okay, so how do we get our hands on the plan? Sergei says we'll have to sneak into the KGB headquarters and steal them. Oh, Sergei says that, does he? He does. The odds will be against us. The place is swarming with agents. Well, Crypto says bring them on. The more the freaking merrier. Okay then. Hmm. Actually, you might be onto something there, Crypto. If you can create a large enough disturbance, it might lure most of the agents out of the building. And while I'm playing monkey ball, you'll sneak in and grab the plans. Gotcha. Okay, dull face, I'm off to stir up the Soviets. Be careful in there, you hear me? Don't worry, Crypto. You keep them occupied, and I'll be just fine. Whatever you do, just keep them away from the HQ building. Good luck.
Intruders down! If there's one thing I can do, it's make with the boom boom. So how about those plans, you swine? They the real deal or what? I just had time to glance at them quickly before the alarms went off. There seem to be a number of tunnels and a lot of security around them. And it looks like the tunnels have these bizarre organic pumps inside, which are what's pumping the radioactive gas over the area. So I take it we're gonna put these organic pumps out of business. Da. But a direct assault would be dangerous. I need to talk to some people. Lay low for a while, Tovarish. I'll be back soon. Why do they always ask me to do the one thing I suck at? Patience is very thin. What are you wanting? Your area of town's been awful quiet lately. You're starting to make the rest of us nervous. Is all being good. We are just not being able to find any subversives. 
either they are being smart, or we are already catching all dumb ones. Is being pity. Maybe you're just not trying enough variety. You keep catching them the same way, soon they wise up. But what other methods are we having? If you are offering idea, I'm being pleased to hear it. You don't want to know. One dissident coming up. I am only wanting true traitor. No run of meal complainers. Be bringing to me. Unharmed. Trusty. Naive as a stitch. Cannot anyone be seeing that my casual cruelty is simply flimsy cover for a turmoil? I am hoping not to get patrol duty. Not I am hoping not to get patrol duty. Not that I'm being afraid of crazies in Patriarca. But I am developing, say, this elbow, and I should probably be resting. Is there any kind of food Americans cannot make fast? I am betting Olga Korbut is weighing less than a duck. We're backing off, do gooders. If we are not having organized crime, we are having kids on. Being such a silly name. Having discipline fetish is not being so bad. And we am in the right country, yet? Why Dr. Olaf is being late? I am getting agitated, but what player who? No one will be noticing you, just be calm. But the revanting? Freedom! Then the revanting it? Then ever, Nora! Same dream over and over. I am hoping. I am wanting to be a change. I am wanting to see in world. Should I be assassinating KGB agents or going to Kremlin for mass bombings? Such choice. I am being like tiny boards like puppy on first sniff of other dogs' poopy. Order. So, you are being traitor to Soviet Union. It's time you are confessing. Confess!
I feel so guilty. Sob. I betrayed my country. Lock me away. Such sincerity. But what are we to be charging you with? All right, I confess. I was the one who drew a bullseye on Lenin's head in hot pink lipstick. Da, but he's being dead. What is he getting? If that is worst you are doing, you are not being traitor at all. All right, I confess, I'm not a traitor at all. There, are you happy? Ha! Now I am knowing you are lying. Be listing true crimes. Loudly and clearly, please. I attacked the rock and killed your dudes. Then I followed Orange Chomped Albion and I killed him too. <laughs> what can I say? I'm a consistent kind of guy. Orangeov and I were growing up together. But why are you being foolish enough to confess him? Yeah, you got me there. I must be crazy giving myself up. Oh, woe is me. Insane people cannot be admitting they are insane. It's first rule of psychology. But I'm having no choice but to believe you. I had hoping this interrogation would be high point. But I'm getting no buzz. Guards, be taking peasant away. You will be rotting in jail, Zadnitsa. Oh! Hey, gorgeous. Did you find out any more about those tunnels? What I found is a scientist who works in the Organic Weapon Technology Program here. He knows all about the machines in those tunnels. I, uh, persuaded him to talk. What'd you find out? Is there any easy way to shut those things down? Those pumping machines are actually organic little nuclear reactors. Incredible! Not to mention highly unstable. A nuclear fuel rod placed inside one will overload it and cause a meltdown. And there just happens to be a nuclear plant in town. Ought to be a few fuel rods lying around. Exactly! If you get some fuel rods, Sergei and I will smuggle them into the tunnels. Okay, Goldie, I'll get your fuel rods for you, but I expect a big reward. Agent Sergei is acquiring some transportation as we speak. He'll meet you when you find them. Hm, you can ask him for your reward. Scientists are conducting many nuclear experiments in town. I suppose it would explain why I am peeing green lately. Am I being drunk? Or am I being just... Please, 
I am loving fuel rods. Slender, strong, such grace, such power. Potential energy of a hundred suns stacked up and waiting for me at Frozen Lake. I could just be running my hands up and down them all night long. Except my hands would fall off. Agent Sergei is waiting with a truck not far from here. I know how you feel about you, Christian, but you must conquer your thirsty issues and take in those fuel rod containers. The sensors on the saucer are picking up some significant radiation levels near you, Crypto. Either Castro's gout is acting up, or there must be fuel rods nearby. Decalypse! Eradicate them! Oh, 
Our cargo has arrived at the safe house. Now, come and see me. We need to talk. Whoa, look at that. Finished already. And here I was, just getting started. Of course, I work out. Don't know if you knew that. Thank you, Crypto. Sergei and I can take it from here. I'll bet. Uh, hey, how about I just stick around and help you out myself? You know, since I'm already here, I'm sure Sergei's a busy guy. You know, embassies to bug, dissidents to torture. You're very generous, Crypto. But I think he can find the time. I'll rejoin you once he and I have disabled the machines in the caves. Until then, try and stay out of trouble. wasn't condescending. Hmm. So, he makes time with my girl while I sit around and twiddle my phalangipods, is that it? Well, homie, don't play that. I made it through a whole nother game all by myself. I don't need anybody's permission to knock some monkey heads. Certainly not some... chicks. Thank you. 
Hello, comrade. Uh, I'm starving and broke. Little help here, what do you say? Sure. If you are telling me which drink caused major problems in Bay City, America recently. Not that that's a weird question or anything, but the answer's revelate. Oh, thank God you're here. I'm so tired of trying to talk like a Russian. You have any idea how hard it is? Not really. You're about to find out. I got a job for you. Paul's going undercover. I think you can handle it. Depends. What's in it for me? Glory, honor. Yeah, I got nothing. But I want revenge. The snitch who got a friend of mine arrested. He's probably dead by now, but the snitch is still alive. He'll be in the food line somewhere nearby. You have problem with that? Laugh while you can, Americans. Your way of life... Why am I having to wait in line for food? For once, I am wishing we are not all equal. So I could be cutting in front of all these losers. Ha <laughs> ha! Why are we feeding proletariat workers? Is science town. They should be feeding scientists. Science town could be developing food pills. Then we are not needing to stand in line. Who am I kidding? It's Soviet Union. We stand in line to die. Am I being right here, people? Hello? Is this thought being on? Science Town is being overrun by proletariat wanting food. Why are we not just sharing food pills? I am not knowing. It's so much simpler. I am hate. I am so hungry. I am wanting to nibble on ear a person in front of me. Wait, that is not being hunger. Destruction, yes. I am knowing I should have been going to the toilet before getting in food line. But how am I knowing would be in line five hours? Getting up, you being all right. Who is there? I have ve- What is that? Science Town is nice to be giving out food. I am not knowing scientists are caring about proletariat. What else is there being? Think they're oh, no! Oh, no! God, I am I'm having no time for this. Potatoes are not fermenting themselves. Stomach is rumbling like moving glacier. Do not worry if you're not knowing what glacier is being, kids. By the time you are playing this game, there will not be any left. Ha ha ha, fools! KGB are having special scientist food pills. Incredibly nutritious. <laughs> Ugh, but not very feeling. be feeding proletariat, hungry people are being easier to beat up. Oh, 
Glad Science Town is having food lines. Ladling out gruel each day was making helmets stink. Uh, are you Come back? Now, don't be shy. Uh, are you hearing of new in major cities? Of I would be feeling guilty for turning over American Spy, but he is having such great shoes. Show me Scrubble, which can stand up to warm toast. false gods, especially ones which are more attractive than mine. Eliminate those idols!
Привет, товарищ. How's it hanging? Little to the left. Hey, not bad, Goldie. So you shut down the pumps in the tunnels with those fuel rods? Нет. Too much KGB heat on the tunnels because of the theft. I should have seen it coming. Anyway, it's too dangerous for Sergei and me to infiltrate them now. Well, we gotta shut those pumps down. Whole town smells like Newark. Oh, we will, Crypto. Have no fear. And this time, I want you on the job. I need you to carry a fuel rod into each of the tunnels and place it in the reactor of each of the pumping machines. Sergei and I have hidden a container of fuel rods near each tunnel. Wait, you, you lost me. Didn't you say the tunnel entrances were crawling with KGB? Da. But not while the scientists conduct their weekly radiation tests. No sweat, dollface. Consider those pumps out of order. What is that?
getting a strange feeling about this place. A strange sort of deja vu. Brains, but I'd kill to know what's under that gas cloud on the surface. Bing, bada boom. Look at those bad boys burn. Hold the phone. What are these freaks? Arkfudo's lines! Your weapons are the hard coloring the warfare. They're practically useless against the thing. You gotta fill me in on this whole blisk thing, Pox. My... my hard drive is spinning. I hardly know where to begin. They're huge, hideous brutes with giant claws and withering halitosis. 
They have a single hive mind and an imperviousness to radiation. They take to it like a pig to mud. Imagine a cockroach mating with a lobster. Oi, enough already. You're making me queasy. Humans assume the Tunguska blast of 1908 was caused by a meteorite. But now we know its true cause. The fiery crash of a Blisk warship! Yeah, well, don't you worry your virtual little head, Pox. This time they're going down for good. A bold statement. Many Furons fell thanks to the Blisk. And there's another problem. Since the war, the Furon defense budget has been... Downsized. I fear that most of our current weapons will be ineffective against the Blisk. Okay, well, at least we know what we're up against. What do you want me to do? I'll contact you with new orders as soon as I have some idea what's going on. Until then, just... don't do anything rash. Rash me? Nah, I got a cream for that. Cleared it right up. If only our mothership was still intact. Its archive data on the disk might have helped me develop weapons upgrades capable of cracking those shells. But that data is irretrievable now. Oh, the Fioronogy!